welcome to Spiritual Wellness Tarot, Virgo, for your next seven-day reading. Let's go ahead and get this started with our overall energy. Angels and spirit guides, what energy does Virgo need to know for the next seven days? What do we need to know for Virgo for the next seven days? Now I ask if this reading resonates with you, Virgo, please go ahead and leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Let's go ahead and we'll pick one out here. I surrender. I am resilient. Allow yourself to relax with the currents of life. These changes will take you even closer to where you are meant to be. So it might be, Virgo, that you have a tendency that you feel like you need to control situations, but you don't. You can surrender. You can go ahead. You can still watch with a, with a loving eye, right? But still, um, still just know that everything is not up to you. You do not need to go ahead and control everything that you can go ahead, allow, and relax to let life go by. Let's see here. Let's get two more cards. We've got the High Priestess. We've got the Two of Swords. And we've got the Knight of Swords. All right, so something's going to be moving fast. Look at the Knight. He's up on, he, um, he's up on his legs. He's moving fast. He's got his wings going. Then we've got the Two of Swords, which is all about having fun, right? Having a partnership. And then we've got the High Priestess, all about intuition, trusting yourself, right? So it's, um, it, it looks like that something may be moving in the next seven days, maybe moving a little faster for you than what you're used to. But realize that what you have, you need to trust your instincts. You need to move forward and trust your instincts. It may be that you have a project at work, right? With this two, with the two of swords. It might be time to compromise. It might be time to make a decision, right? Um, and realize that if it is a project or something like that, you don't have to control the whole situation, right? You can allow yourself to relax and let the other person help control it. Let's see, we've got the six of cups. We've got the Five of Swords, and we've got the Seven of Wands. All right, so with the High Priestess, we've got this, the Six of Cups, which is, you know, it's just good memories, right? Reunions, being happy. Look at how she's, how she's being so generous. She's brought six, six cups worth of flowers, and she's going to hand them out to the people that are in the kingdom, in the neighborhood and things so it's definitely um she is she is trusting her intuition as far as the high priestess goes she trusts herself and she knows that everything is good she's going to go ahead and surrender enjoy life she's going to hand out her cups because that's what she enjoys to do and it helps her become closer to herself right and then we have the two of swords two of swords is all about making a decision there's two of you so so what decision are you going to make? Well, you've got the five of swords. He's got, he's got two swords down, one sword in this hand, and two more swords to go, to go with him, right? So he might have felt defeated, right? He might have thought, well, gosh, is this, um, there, you know, I only have two swords left. What else am I going to need to do? Well, remember, you don't have to control the situation, Virgo, you don't have to control the situation. You can let them go and you can take your two swords and move forward, right? Move forward, relax, and let the currents of life take you forward. And then we have the seven of wands and it is clarifying the knight of swords. Knight of swords is all about a change, right? Very strong, very fast change. And with the seven of swords, He's, um, you know, he's just not quite sure. He's, he doesn't know. He's got his six swords down here or six wands down here. And then he is ready for this, for this seventh one, right? What does he need to do with that seventh one? He's feeling like he needs to protect himself, right? He's feeling like he needs to control. And Virgo, you don't have to control all the time. 
It's okay to move forward, right? Let go. It's not, it's not healthy to control all the time, right? And actually, it's kind of fun not to have to control all the time. I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I don't want to have to be in control, right? <laughs> There's so much in, in life right now. Sometimes it's just great to go ahead and, and let somebody else be in control. Okay, our angel card, improving health. And what did I just say about health, right? It's not healthy to be in control all the time. And so it's time to start working on your health and surrendering, right? And it does, it's, you're not surrendering in a bad way, right? It's not like you're surrendering to war, right? You're just realizing that you don't have to be in control all the time, right? And although we all like to be right all the time, it's okay to, to agree to disagree, right? It's okay to agree to disagree. And definitely, um, once you let go of some of that control and you allow yourself to relax, your health is going to improve. Your health, um, well, I see your health improving. You know, it's just time, time to relax. Let's get one last card here. There is no blame. I release the need to blame anyone, including myself. We are all doing the best we can with the understanding, knowledge, and awareness we have. I release the, the need to blame anyone. There is no blame. And that, that can come right into control, right? If we feel, even if we feel that the situation that we're talking about is maybe not quite right, but it was our idea and we feel the need to control it, that, that will wreak have it, on, have it on your health. Right, it's you need to realize even if it was your your situation, you don't have to control everything. Right, just just surrender and relax. Let's see here. Let's get one affirmation for Virgo. One affirmation for Virgo, please, angels. Focus on your dreams. Allow the power of manifesting to start now. Yep, that's, which, that's exactly right, right? Go ahead and realize that you can manifest. You can go ahead and help and ask for guidance on how to not want to control everything, right? Um, allow yourself to relax with the currents of life. These changes will take you even closer to where you are meant to be. Allow the power of manifesting to start now. All right, Virgo, you guys have a great um, next seven days, and we will talk to you soon. Namaste.